Well, we're down the road here again, and uh, this time we have the T. No, it's not the T1. <laughs> it's the F01 Power Cruiser. Um, you know, I've been uh, one of those guys telling you to say 20 auto, 28 or 6 motors uh, with a 7 inch prop is awesome. And uh, in fact, it is. Uh, you got power, endless power, but um, you're stuck on a certain range of stick position which uh, gives you not too much control of, of slow flights and not too much speed after all anyways i've switched i've switched over to something like this it's a 2208 uh, motor with 1800 kv and the gem fan flash uh, 6.4 Just FPV. It has been taking about one and a half month for me to get this motor, which I ordered in May. Now, it's June. Well, I'm not very come very far because I wanted to check this motor out and swap it out to, uh, against uh, 2807 Emax here. And this is now flight uh, 2208 with 1800 kV and I will stick a 6 inch prop on this one instead of the 7 inch prop. This one is pretty cool, yet I think this could be more than ever again. I will try this out for you. Let's uh, demontage the thing here, get the motor wires out and swap out the motor, shall we? Everything back in place, I hope I reconnected everything right. Let's do a little test room. Express LRS is running. I can't see the retakes now. Okay, LEDs, motor, everything is good. I think we wired it up perfectly. Now uh, we need to balance our six inch prop. Right? Right. Everything ready and montaged and uh, if you compare it, you can see which size difference there is. Now, the 2807 was nice. It was really nice with the 7 inch prop. But I think we can get some more power and dynamic behavior out of this little thingy. Which uh, should do very well on a 6x4 inch prop. We're gonna find out soon.
this feels much more comfortable to fly. And why is that? Apparently, the balancing of the motor and the prop compared to the bigger setup oh, is much more nice somehow. <laughs> somehow much nicer. You can fly um, faster. You can fly pretty efficient with about uh, two to three amps. And oh, that's pretty cool. So yeah, that's fun. That's the way I like it. <laughs> that's what I've been fishing for. So um, uh, test flight today was uh, a good thing, and I'm happy. Perhaps I will look for a new, new prop, which is a little, a little more brutal, because the motor can easy handle it. And uh, then we'll get some nice cruises again with the weather, if the weather is with us soon. For now, this is uh, just a short heads up, and uh, after you've seen the footage, you can see the consumption is much more interesting than before. Well, I have some issues with uh, my uh, setup because my receiver tells me too often it has no reception, and that's not good. Compared to the other receiver I have, it has no problem. In the T1, no problem. In this one, there is a problem. I uh, changed the receiver already, so must be the antenna, perhaps. I would check that and change it. Anyways, that's it for now. Just a short heads up on the F01 Power Cruiser, and I can tell you, this is fun. That's how I wanted it to, to be. So, um, yes, this setup currently is my preferred setup. The most, the best, and the least consumption. The most power, the most speed, the best fun in my face, a smile in my face, and the least power consumption on the battery. Have a good one. I'm off now. I'm driving home. Bye bye. Be seeing ya. Forget to hit the subscribe button. That would be awesome. That would be awesome. That would be awesome.